and then the war came. Mm. So I joined the WAF. Oh, cool. So I was an NCO in the ladies in the in the Air Force. And I stayed in there. I volunteered. Well it, I mean it was one way of getting out of the mill. Well, yeah. And uh, I volunteered and they accepted me medical and everything. And then I went into the OAP. So I spent a lot of years in the OAP and I, I was a, an MT driver. Wow. Yeah, had some exciting times. As a, <laughs> and I was in the OAP all that time and I oh, went all over driving. I was a driver, yes, yeah. so, a sergeant driver, yeah, with the Air Force and we used to move about. Mm. Just used to. Get, get settled in one place and then they bought the start bombing and then we'd have to move and oh well, you live from day to day you didn't know where you were no you didn't know where you were ground I liked it <laughs> it's awful isn't it but it, I did enjoy it they were used to move squadrons they said that, oh, they were moving this but well, we were attached to a squadron you see if they moved nearer to south of England so that they could bomb Germany and that. Yeah. Well, we had to go with them because we were the only means of transport, you see. So all the wives had to go down and mass. And I used to have to lead, lead them and, oh, very exciting. Yeah. 